The Senate President, Ahmad Lawan, has appealed to the Federal Capital Development Authority to fix the dilapidated part of the National Assembly and save it from further roof leakages. Lawan made the appeal at the foundation lane of the permanent office complex of the National Assembly Service Commission, NASC. He said the National Assembly leadership would continue to provide the needed infrastructure to ensure that the institution delivers on its mandate to Nigerians. He said the provision of the needed infrastructure would guarantee and enhance productivity of the legislature in service delivery. When we came in 2019, we saw the necessity, the need to rehabilitate the National Assembly uh, complex. And those who have been working in this National Assembly complex and those who have been members of the National Assembly since 1999 know that this is a project that is necessary, that this National Assembly complex needs rehabilitation. At this point, that I want to talk the right message to the Federal Ministry, the, the, the FCT and the FCDA to immediately conclude all the procedures and processes for awarding the contract for the rehabilitation of the National Assembly complex. The Commission's chairman, Ahmad Amshi, described the construction of the NASC Permanent Office Building as a historic feat recorded under the Ninth Assembly. The Fifth National Assembly Service Commission found it expedient to re-engage trade associates for the stage three of the project, considering their professional competence and to ensure continuity. At inception in 2010, the construction cost of the project was estimated at 2.5 billion naira. But as of today, the cost of the project is 11.65 billion naira due to inflationary trends and incorporation of modern materials and facilities to the building. When we came in, we reviewed the design, we maintained the architectural design, but look, we looked at some of the facilities to be provided and we felt that they needed to be upgraded. The nation's parliament leadership cried out a few months ago that the complex could collapse with the constant leakages of its roof during downpour.